Hello, in this video we're going to perform a speed test between Redmi 15C and Redmi 15. Alright, so uh, in this video we're going to uh, perform a test when it comes to the speed of uh, opening uh, the apps. Also, uh, I'll perform a benchmark and I'll show you the results uh, so you can take a look on the numbers. Uh, so let's try uh, with the speed of opening the apps first. Uh, let's uh, open up the camera app for example. At first, of course, I will open up uh, a few apps and we will see if there are some differences when it comes to the speed. Uh, let's begin with the camera app. And also, I'll make sure that uh, in the recent apps we I don't we don't have anything. Okay, and let's begin. Let's tap on the camera app. All right, it was a little bit faster on the Redmi 15. Now let's try this again. And now the app is open in the background, so uh, there's a chance that we will take less. Uh, but let's check. Okay, again, a little bit faster, maybe like a half second on the, into the advantage of the Redmi 15. Now let's try with different app. Let's launch the Chrome. Uh, okay, uh, I think it was pretty similar uh, because in here I'm not uh, logged in and I need to hit the continue. Uh, actually, let me do it. Mm, and uh, we'll do it once again. Okay, uh, let me close the apps and let's tap once again. In this case, it was the same. And I couldn't see any difference. Now let's open up the message app. Okay. A little bit faster on the Redmi 15. Uh, that is not a big difference, but uh, you will notice uh, that uh, that difference uh, when it comes to the day-to-day uh, -day use. But I'm just take, I'm just performing this test to show you if there are some differences. There are, but they are so small that I would say that they don't even exist. Let's stop again on the Messages app. Again really really similar and next thing maybe the settings okay in this case again uh, the redmi 15 was a little bit faster than the redmi 15c i think something like half second uh, faster okay and now uh, let's launch uh, the last app and maybe the gallery. Okay, again the Redmi 15, but in this case it wasn't like even a half second, it was like 0 0.3. Let's stop again. And now, uh, when the app is uh, actually already opened in the background, uh, there is no difference uh, in the speed for me when we are tapping once again. Uh, you could uh, see it right now. Okay, now uh, we have a lot of apps opened uh, in the background. Uh, let me only see if they are the same. And uh, one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, okay, so now uh, let's try to switch between the recent apps uh, and let's see uh, the difference between them. So let's try to open the last app. In this case, the settings. Okay, maybe on the 15, it, it was a little bit faster. Of course, there is a chance uh, that uh, I'm tapping on one of the phone a little bit uh, faster because it's really hard to, you know, press at the same time. Uh, so that was uh, uh, the opening app from uh, recent apps. And now let's try to open the last app. So it will be camera in our case and let's tap to see if there will be a huge difference. Okay, the Redmi 15 was again faster, but there are no big differences when it comes to that. Uh, if that would be day-to-day -day use, uh, I'm sure that you wouldn't even notice uh, those uh, differences. 
Uh, all right, uh, as a last thing, I think we can perform a benchmark test, uh, the CPU benchmark. Uh, I'll use the Geekbench app for this test. In here you can see some information about uh, the devices and let's run the test and I'll see you back again once we have the results. Alright, so now we have our results for our CPU. Uh, the results are really similar to each other. On the Redmi 15C, the single core score is 404. The multi-core score is 1300. While on the Redmi 15, single core is 473. And multi-core is 1545. So, uh, the differences uh, in that uh, level of... Uh, <laughs> Those differences uh, aren't big uh, in the numbers, they're really close to each other. It's not like uh, in here we have 400, in here we have uh, 900 or, I don't know, 1000. That would be a difference. Uh, but uh, when it comes to that, it's really similar to each other. Uh, and also that is why uh, when we are uh, tapping on the uh, apps, when we are switching between them, uh, there were no uh, big uh, differences. Uh, maybe the 15 was a little bit faster. Uh, but, uh, just like I was saying, there are no big differences and you wouldn't notice them in day-to-day -day use. Uh, in here we can also scroll down a little so you can see the system information. Also the CPU. Now the single core performance. In here we also have the integer score and the floating point score. On the Redmi 15C it's 431 on 15 522 floating point score on the 15 C is 358 and the floating point score on the 15 is 393 so they are clo really close to each other and here we have some other information now we have the multi-core Uh, in here, I'll also scroll gently so you can see uh, the values. And now, when it comes to the multi core, uh, the integer score is uh, 1384, the floating point score is 1158 on the 15C, and on the Redmi 15, we have 1569 and 1502. So, again, really close to each other. Alright, and that's all in this video. Thank you all for watching. If you found this video helpful, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe.